Hey guys, I am here today playing some Red Dead Redemption 2. Today guys, I'll be going over one of the game's revolvers, the Lamat revolver. So, I'll be doing, maybe if this video does good, a series on like the different weapons in Red Dead. And maybe, if you guys want, I'll leave a comment down below if you do a playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2. It's one of my favorite games and you know I might just do a playthrough anyways because I love this game so much guys. It's one of the best games I think I've ever played and I'm sure you guys agree with me. But anyways, I'm going to be doing a video today on the Lamat Revolver and if it's any good in Red Dead Redemption 2. Alright guys, as you can see, the stats of the Lamat revolver are pretty good. Um, the damage is pretty average for a revolver, the range is average for a revolver, but the accuracy, it's pretty high. The fire rate is pretty good for a revolver, and the reload speed is pretty good for a revolver too. Can I help you find something? So. I'm gonna go. Let's let's compare this to the another really popular choice in this is the Showfield, which the real rate is like max and the accuracy is like max. And as you can see, the range is better than the Lamat revolver as well. All the stats are better than the Lamat revolver. Looks like you've been taking and good so care of that that's gun. why I guess a lot of people choose the Lamat or the Showfield over the Lamat revolver is because the Showfield. If I'm saying that right, sh uh, yeah, that's the only way you can really say it. Showfield. It is. It's just it's a much better option than the Lamat, but there's something special about the Lamat revolver that no other gun in story and single player mode has that I know of at least I don't I don't know I don't think no nothing else has this option the Lamat revolver has a second gun in it it's got a shotgun in it so you can see the stats for the show field if you're wondering whether to use the show field or the Lamat Pick the show field. It's it's just gonna be better for you. Trust me. Let's see Great. once we come out here as you can see I, I don't have my Lamat like okay there we go. With the express rounds the show field is pretty nice. But anyway yeah, but you see, my, my show field's in the worst of worst condition. That's why all the stats are kind of bad, guys. But. You can see here. There's shells. That's shotgun shells, guys. So you see. If I whip my pistol out here. There's an option. In the bottom right corner of my screen. If I hit the D-pad, because I'm playing on Xbox controller right now. Well, I'm, play I'm playing on Xbox right now anyway, guys. If I hit the D-pad to the right, it's in the bottom right corner of your screen. You flip a little switch in the gun on the back. And that is a shotgun. Now, you have one shotgun shell loaded. It's in the middle of... Yeah, it's on like the little pipe under the gun. Here, let's inspect the gun real quick. See that little pipe under it? That one that's really big? Under the main barrel where the regular rounds come out of? There's a shotgun shell chambered in the center, I believe, of the Lamat revolver. As you can see there. And my weapon... Um, it has better accuracy and that kind of stuff. It's because I have upgraded the length of my barrel and the rifling in it.
but anyways, guys, let's go. I'm not gonna test it out. Let's go. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna go find some uh, fortunate people to test this thing on. So we can see the damage that the the Matt revolver causes and see how well it does. Oh uh, well um Alright guys. So you can see here we are out in near Saint Denis. Saint Denis. The town's right over there. Right behind those trees oh not right behind those trees. You can see one of the factories right there. But um I just gotta get some policemen to come out. So right, we gotta shoot some people. Yep, so now the policemen are gonna come out. And we're gonna test this thing out in some combat. Uh we're gonna see how hold I can how long I can hold out with the Lamat revolver. Now, I am gonna put express ammo in. It increases the damage. And if you want to maximize your range with this use high velocity adds a tad bit of damage I like express it adds a lot more damage and but it doesn't increase range so that's what I'm going with and it looks like we got policemen approaching from over here One shots two shots and it is pretty accurate, I will say. It's not the fastest shooting gun. That was the show field. My bad. My bad. Still going with the map. It takes a long time to load it, as you can see. I put like four rounds into that guy. And see, from range, that's range though, so range is not so good at range. I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you guys that. Of course, it's one shot to the head. Like, I'm pretty sure all guns. How did he get up there? Still keep making sure I got the Lamat clip. Alright. Okay, I'm about to die already okay so I just died didn't hold out that long I wasn't in cover though and I wasn't really running so that is the the map pistol the mod the map against Policeman. Now, let's try the shotgun mode. Now, for the shotgun mode, the best thing to do is hold up somewhere. Like, in the bar, let's say. Like, camping behind, like, a one-way, like, if it's a one-way, if it's a house that only has, like, a one-way entrance, the trick is, you just camp the doorway. So let's go find something to hide in. Probably up here. Yeah, there's a clothing store. Uh, maybe I can rob him in the process. I don't know if you can rob the uh, clothing store or not. Insane to me. That's the wrong entrance. I can start unarmed assaulting people. Oh, disturbing the peace now. Okay, friend. Open the register right now. Now no one needs to die over this. Just take what you want. Okay. Okay, now stay calm, because I'll give you everything in the register. Here, please, now just leave me be. Okay, so this guy we're robbing this guy. How much money are we gonna get? Not a lot. Not we'll a lot never make it if things continue like okay. this. 
Now we're gonna hog tie him so I don't really have to kill him and blow his head off with the shotgun. We don't really want to do that to somebody who we don't really have to. That's the Lamat shotgun for you. Pistol shotgun. Okay, let's I'm gonna hide right here. It won't let me get in trouble. Scar okay, reload speed. I'm gonna be totally honest for something that's not really a shotgun. Okay. I am surrounded right now. I am totally surrounded. Okay, I'm gonna fall back to this room back here. See if I can hide behind this. Okay. see it's really effective in close range combat the shotgun size so if you're in in door fight like inside fighting the Lamat it works really well especially since it you're basically carrying a is there somebody inside oh my gosh there's somebody on the other side you're but like I was saying you're basically carrying a pistol and a shotgun in one so there's no need to carry an extra shotgun. Of course, if you have the semi-automatic shotgun and you put slugs in it, well, you can't really beat that, I will say. But, well, that's pretty much everything about the Lamat revolver, guys. Um, If you guys um leave a comment on what you really think or like your opinion on the Lamat revolver and make sure to put a comment down below whether or not you want me to do a Red Dead Redemption 2 playthrough. I mean, I really op I'm really open to doing a playthrough in it, especially since I it's a game I enjoy. Tell me, please, guys. Where's this person saying, let me vote? Okay, I'm just going to say this real quick. I was trying to buy some clothes from the tailor shop, and it, I was in there for like... 10 in real life minutes and that's all I heard the whole time let me vote let me vote let me go I swear that noise drove me crazy bro well thank you guys for watching and hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to uh, drop a like and subscribe